Hello and welcome to this video. The royal couple could each get a team of protection officers while spending up to three years in Africa if the reported plan goes ahead. Meghan Markle and Prince Harry's security bill to move to Africa could reach a million pounds a year, it is claimed. Harry's advisors are reportedly working to create a role that capitalises on the couple's rock star status that could see the pair move to the continent for up to three years. But such a move would require a dedicated team of Metropolitan Police Royal Protection Officers, each to accompany them, the Sun reports. Their as yet unborn baby would also be entitled to its own security, the paper adds. These security details could come with a hefty price tag, met by the British taxpayer. A security consultant estimated that could be in the region of £750,000 a year, according to The Sun, with a further £250,000 to cover travel, medical and insurance costs for staff. Former Scotland Yard commander John O'Connor has raised concerns about safety and called for the family to help meet the costs. Southern Africa is not safe by any means, and Islamic State have strongholds across the continent, he told the newspaper. It's only right that the royal family themselves contribute towards the security costs of protecting Harry and Meghan when they are there. Royal experts have already warned costs could scupper the move, admit Brexit, and continued austerity from the Tory government. Ingrid Seward, editor of Majesty magazine, said she doubted it will come about. But she added, what Harry wants, Harry gets and he always said he would like to live in Africa, so we will see. Royal sources say the African scheme is one of a number of options, but nothing is off limits, as informal plans would not be in place until next year. But the couple are said to be keen to explore the idea in more detail after settling into life as new parents, even though it could fuel talk of a rift between Harry and his brother Prince William. A royal source said, Harry has spoken about his love of Africa, in particular Botswana, which he has referred to as his second home. It is widely understood that Harry and Meghan fell in love in Botswana and they returned there for Meghan's 36th birthday in 2017. Meghan sees the role as hugely exciting and something that could affect real change. The Duchess has long been an advocate of global causes. She has worked with the United Nations and charities such as World Vision across Africa and India. Thank you for watching this video. For the latest in celebrity news, please subscribe to my channel.